Welcome to the Carl and Ginger channel. Welcome back. You might wonder why we are trying to level this table. We're gonna use these hula hoops to make a giant tortilla for our giant gummy taco. <laughs> gummy liquid. That looks like real beef and real cheese. Yeah. Every day is a new day, so make it an awesome one. I'm like a gummy making fruit ninja now with my giant whisks. We got two big pots. We're gonna make a ton of gummy and we have a lot of prep work to get done. We're gonna take these hula hoops together so that we have like a mold for the tortilla that we can fold in half to make the taco. We've got the hula hoops, I mean the tortilla mold, <laughs> tortilla. taped to the table. And now we're gonna stretch this tablecloth over. And then when we pour the gummy down in here, it's gonna take the shape of our taco tortilla mold. <laughs> and now we gotta make all the molds for the meat and the lettuce and the tomatoes and all that fun stuff. Ginger's making the lettuce molds. So we use crinkled tin foil. And then we put green colored gummy in there to make it look like lettuce. Hopefully this time we can get the gummy mixture right. I'm trying to figure out how to do it without measuring everything. But when we did the giant gummy worm, it just came out like jello. So we're gonna try and fix that this time. When we did the gummy worm, we did like three and a half boxes of gelatin. Each one of these is two boxes worth. So we're basically gonna have two, four, six boxes worth of gelatin this time to try and get the gummy perfect. These giant whisks are gonna be perfect. Good find, Ginger. Thanks. It's time to get the lettuce molds ready because I think our gummy is just about done. That is a lot of gummy, Carl. <laughs> we probably have way too much, but we're gonna scoop some out of here. That looks good. It looks like the gummy does look like it's working pretty good. Yeah. Bring it over here. Okay, Kyle, why don't you add the drops of green? Don't get it on your clothes. Maybe put like, I don't know, try five drops. Okay. One, two, three. Five. That's good. Let's see what that looks like. Does that look like green lettuce? Ooh, let's add a little bit more. Yeah. Let's add five more and make it nice and green. Four, five. Oh, that looks pretty good. <laughs> it's time to pour it. Gummy lettuce coming right up. Gonna That's going to look really awesome. Yeah, we're going to do thick lettuce this time. Hopefully we have enough. I think we will. The crinkles in the foil give it the really perfect lettuce texture. There we go. Now we just let this cool. In the meantime, we wash our bowls out. And then what should we do next, Kyle? The meat or the cheese? Let's do the meat. The meat. Oh, he's a pro. He's, he's a gummy a, pro. He's a gummy pro. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well fill her up a little bit here, huh? Because I think we've got plenty of gummy. We have this like Coca-Cola colored food coloring. It's like caramel color that we're going to make it look like hamburger meat, hopefully. That's the idea. So how are we going to cut it up like the chunks of hamburger meat that we usually put in tacos? We're going to, yeah, we're going to keep stirring it. Ooh, that's a lot. I might have put way too much in, huh? No, that looks really good. Does it look good? It looks good. As it starts to cool, we'll just keep stirring it so it's all ground oh, up. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> we're going to make this milky with milk. That's, whoa, whoa that's tons. Ooh. That's tons. Oh, that's going to add yellow. Like this is going to be our cheese. Yeah. That totally looks like, it looks like a broken egg right now, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Like a raw egg. Gross. We're going to stir that up. It totally looks <gasps> like raw egg, doesn't it? That is crazy. I think that looks like a perfect cheese color. Perfect cheese. I would really like to get ideas down in the comments below of what giant stuff you guys want to see us make because they're so fun, actually, to make giant gummy things. And uh, when we're moving into our new house, I want to do even bigger stuff. Like, if this video gets like 20,000 likes, should we make like a 10 foot burrito? Yeah! Yes! Like a 10 foot long gummy burrito. That would be awesome. So, this is our ground beef, our cheese, and our lettuce. I What's think, next? I think we need tomatoes. 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 I think we should 
do the tortilla next? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what color. Should we, what, should we do like a white soft shell tortilla or like a crunchy taco type? That's My vote is crunchy taco. Yeah, what? crunchy taco. Because if crunchy we do taco. the 10 foot burrito, we're going to want a big white tortilla for that. Yeah, to that's up, true. Right? We're going to try and make the crunchy taco shell look super ultra realistic mm -hmm. as much as you can with gummy. So we're going to use some of this brown for the hamburger meat. You know how taco shells are kind of like burnt little speckles and stuff? Yeah. So we're just going to like make little drizzles around and then we're going to pick those off and lay them around on the taco shell to give it that kind of brown color. So everybody just grab a little bit and lay it out mm -hmm. like a little bit of gummy. Oh, like the kind to of up. toasted bits. Awesome. The taco shell. That looks so good. <laughs> I'm sure I didn't get any other pieces of gummy in there. Or it doesn't really matter. Every day is a new day, make it nothing. Classy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to color the tortilla. I mean, just take your best stab at it, babe. We'll do it like cheese, but then we'll maybe add a little bit of red to or cola color to make it dull. I don't know. It might just end up being a hot mess, but. It'll be a Doritos Locos taco. <laughs> we just add a little bit of red. <laughs> no, that's and way Doritos do Now Locos we taco. have bright orange. <laughs> it's gonna look like some crazy Good. gummy taco. <laughs> I've never seen a taco shell this color. Oh, that actually doesn't look too bad. It's looking better and better. Should I add a little Maybe cola color just... or is that going to muddle it up? Uh, that kind of looks like an orange, so. <laughs> now you got me thinking about Doritos. I have an idea. <laughs> Tomorrow, when all this is cooled and we put it together, we go to Taco Bell and get the taco that looks most like it, and it will just be like, we totally meant to do it like this Doritos taco, and no one will know until no we get this far know. into the video. All right, check my drawers. Follow me, girl. Last thing I want Follow to do is be carrying a giant pot of gummy and have my pants go whoosh. <laughs> that would be my Boom. best day. Everywhere. It weighs like. Okay, you have to pour it so it's like slowly. A man competition. Oh. oh my gosh, it's really oh. heavy. Oh. I hope this pit, uh, tablecloth doesn't have a hole in it. <laughs> that would be interesting. Hang on, we need to kind of tuck it. We got to get that perfect Doritos Los Tacos shape <laughs> in a circle. As best we can, no uh -huh. slanted edges. Hey, that looks pretty darn good though. It really does. You even got the burnt bits in there, it's gonna look totally like taco shell. I think that's, that's good. good. That's good. We have to just, yeah. Let's, let's get an egg and drill a hole in it and do something with this. We'll make them tomato shaped and then if we decide to dice them up, we can do that. It just looks like fruit punch to me and <laughs> I just wanna drink it. <laughs> <laughs> it would not be good, I promise. We got a little red left over from making our Tomatoes, so we're gonna make some salsa. Salsa, salsa. caliente. Salsa. <laughs> Look at this crazy gummy kitchen that we got going on here. Just like the gummy just hamburger. Have, it is like the gummy hamburger. And Luke had a great idea that we should do like a gummy breakfast, like pancakes, eggs, bacon. I love that. That would be really fun. Carl's got himself a big pink egg. With a hole in the top, we're gonna hot glue gun around it, and then we're gonna put a funnel in there. Gummy Easter egg, yet, just for fun. Oh snap. <laughs> there you go. It's gonna be super green. Hopefully it doesn't leak out everywhere. Worst case scenario. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. There must be foam, because the dark is right oh, here. Oh yeah, there's foam in there, huh? Well, all the molds have been poured, including a bonus giant gummy Easter egg, everything, we have a huge mess in the kitchen now. So now we just wait overnight for everything to set up and then we put it together first thing in the morning. It's time to put together the giant gummy taco and to celebrate this momentous occasion we got the 12 taco pack. This is not sponsored video but if you want to give us money to Taco Bell feel free. <laughs> <laughs> Kids are dying. Make that more joke. <laughs> we were joking because we messed up the tortilla shell and made it orange. 
But that's okay, because now it's a Doritos Los Tacos with an orange shell, right? So that's what we were going for from the beginning, right? Yeah. It's all planned. Before we build this taco, there's a link down in the description if you want to come and meet us. We're going to be at CVX Live this year in August in Salt Lake City, Utah. And we have a very special link down in the description box where you can go get tickets now before it sells out. So while you're going and buying your tickets and stuff after this video, in the meantime, it's time to put in the ground beef. We're just going to put it on this half. Okay. This half. <laughs> and we're going to keep it down here on the bottom. Yeah, so it can be like a taco. It is a taco, a giant gummy taco. Okay, that's probably good. That's probably, well, yeah, let's just do it. <laughs> okay, oh, and for the gummy cheese. Ginger, you want a piece of hamburger? Hey! Right oh! On on you got those guys! <laughs> that looks like real beef and real cheese. It looks so good. It is! It's a giant it's, gummy taco. It's, this, it's real! Alright, time for Let's do it. A little bit of tomato. <laughs> Looks like you got some options there, Carl. Yeah, these kind of turned out weird. These, I don't, they I'm look like pancakes. I'm <laughs> not feeling the tomato vibe going on. But our salsa actually looks like diced tomatoes more than salsa, so it's now our tomato. <laughs> oh, is it coming off? Peel it oh. off of there, guys. Oh, it's like a little crusty on the edges of it. Eh. Gross. Oh yeah, you guys, that's looking good. Looking like a taco. Here comes our lettuce. Our lettuce. Lettuce. Put on the lettuce. Lettuce. That looks so cool. It does look cool. It does. Look at that. Looks like a big oh. leaf of lettuce, doesn't it? Yeah. That is really hard to get. Oh, I got it. Never mind. There we go. Shredded lettuce. Okay, getting this lettuce off there. Whoa, this is a big one. Whoa. We want some of it like poking up off the top, right? Like that it looks like a legit taco. So awesome. All right, it's time to fold this thing over. Ooh. We're going to fold the shell now. We're gonna try not to tear the thing. Kind of have to roll it. It's a giant taco. It's totally a taco. Oh man, <laughs> look at the little burn marks. You got the, so the little cool. burn marks. So here's the goals. We're gonna try and get the hula hoops out. Okay, ready? Lift. That's so handy. Pull it out. Oh, try and get the tablecloth fixed. It. Fix the tablecloth. Oh, Straighten it out. It's over by mom where it needs to be pulled that way. Pull it down towards mom's knees. There you go. Okay, let's set this thing down. Ooh, taco. Got some, that's what always happens when you eat a taco, right? The ground beef oh, kind of spills out. It's really greasy, too. It is greasy. I didn't want it to stick, so it's like really cooking spray. Oh, no, oh, no. Is it it's splitting? splitting? It's splitting. Oh, man. Now we have the tacos on tacos on tacos Just on the table. Look at the scale comparison. <laughs> Ready? Gummy taco. So awesome. <laughs> it's huge. It's huge. Giant. Here's the thing. Look at this. You know how when you get a crunchy taco shell, when you take the first bite, the bottom splits? Yeah. Ours actually split across the bottom right there. So it's just more realistic. It's more realistic, like a real taco. Should I try and stand it up? Yeah. Oh, <sighs> it's, so <sighs> it's so big. I don't think we can do okay. it. Okay. Oh. Which taco is the tastiest, Kyle? This one. <laughs> Those are really good, though. They are. They're so Dang! good. We still have the giant gummy. Oh my egg. goodness! Grab, grab it. Don't eat all the tacos, Gage. Maybe I want to. <laughs> I have like cooking oil everywhere. I think you're mold held. Good job, Carl. You gummy king. I'm getting kind of rough with this. Hopefully, I don't. I didn't break it here. Please don't rip. Please don't rip. Hey! hey, hey. That looks so good. Oh, it's like vacuum sealed. I wonder if it can stand by itself. I don't know. I don't think it can. Whoa! Oh, there we go! Look at that! Giant <laughs> gummy Easter egg! <laughs> Look how big it is. It's like bigger than Luke's head. I know, I'm not saying something. <laughs> <laughs> Should we see if it bounces in the kitchen? Yeah! 
Oh, oh it is so Let's get close and we'll get a slow-mo of the bounce. Giant gummy Easter egg super bounce in slow motion. Here you guys go. giant gummy video thanks for subscribing and supporting our family make sure and click the link down in the description box to come and see us at cvx live the link is down below and remember that every day is a new day so make it an awesome one bye, bye.